What is good everybody? Welcome back to another My Name Toys video. Today we're going to be talking about all of these boxes full of WWE figures. So ladies and gentlemen, as you know, if you follow me on Instagram, you know that a few days ago I posted a video of me loading up boxes full of these WWE figures and what I've done here is I have gotten a new house me and my wife have bought a new house and I gotta move the MDT figure room I gotta move it so you know what this is the new room right here I already got the zebra curtain hanged I've already got the blackout curtain over that because this room gets really hot if that sun's just coming in through there it will eat this room alive but I'm trying to figure out how I should do my setup I got all these all my figures right here in these loose boxes so many this one over here is full of my custom so you guys don't have to worry about all of them chipping I do have them taken care of over there as well as the crowd the crowds actually buried underneath there what I'm thinking is I'm gonna go this wall right here is gonna be the crowd and arena you know what I'm saying I'm gonna have I'm gonna have the crowd going from this wall to that wall with my silver tables as you can see I got the ring right here got some Ziggler stuff got my crowd right there rest of its underneath this pile of rubbish over there but here's another view from the thing. There's where we did our video from uh, yesterday. Got more stuff piled up over here. There's still plenty of stuff at the other house that we gotta move, but uh, I'm very excited, guys. Uh, I'm very, very excited to get this room all set up. I plan on doing my shelves different. I don't think I'm gonna have those other shelves I had. I believe I'm gonna bring some uh, floating shelves in, you know what I'm saying, and hang them on the wall. That way I can have each superstar lined up how I want on each wall. So, um, I want to show you these boxes real quick, show you how they're organized. So in this box we got the Kevin Owens, the Sami Zayn's, we got some Jericho's in here. I believe a lot of Triple H's are at the bottom. We got some AJ Styles, Johnny Gargano and Ciampa, Aiden English, a bunch of custom stuff I was working on as well as you can see with these uh, Kenny Omega parts right here on the left. Right here we have all of my loose John Cena's. Do not worry, all of my John Cena shelf is in here and I packaged up all of them in Ziploc baggies to make sure they would not get damaged. Also I have my armband in there that I caught at that Smackdown event so I wanted to make sure I kept all those together. Even if they're Mattel made, I put them in the baggies just so you know I wouldn't damage any of them. Over here we just have the jobber shelf. They're, these figures don't suck necessarily, they're just uh, the ones that were on my bottom shelf at the other house. Uh, they're just kind of shoved in there. Um, I did lay these softly, you know, I didn't slam them in there, I just sat them down that way, you know, I didn't get any paint rub or anything. I, I feel confident about it, so I'm not really worried if they're damaged. Um, I don't think they are, so, you know, moving on. Over here we have another shelf that I had, uh, had just thrown in there. I got a lot of New Day in here, got some Rikishi, got some Network Spotlights, Basics, IRS, Xbox, C, and Almas. Got uh, Corey Graves over there, Mark Henry, got that Superman figure I still haven't sold. Really do need to sell that, sick of looking at it. But yeah, these, these boxes, some of these boxes are massive and some of them are, you know, short. You see, this one's short, this one's pretty deep, this one's pretty deep. The biggest one though, that's full of customs and the crowd over there, so... That's just to show you how many freaking customs and baggies I got shoved over there. It's pretty ridiculous. Here's another shot of the John Cena box. As you can see, guys, I have them all bagged. Like, every single one of them are bagged up. Just to make sure I didn't damage any of them again. Um, I also have this loose bag full of all of my Cena accessories. I need to get customized arms, hats, all of the different attires I need to get made. So, um, that's that. Over here, we got the Dead Gum Kurt Angles, Rocks, and Roman Reigns all together. As you can see, I believe... Um, there may be a few other superstars, Lita, and possibly the Hardy Boys are in here somewhere, so um, I'm going to have to make sure I keep those in so they don't get all messed up. Over here we have my Stone Cold, Seth Rollins, and Edges, Canes, Dean Ambrose, anywhere that was like near on that one shelf, if you guys remember, I have these all together, Batista's in here. And a few of the jobber shelves is in here as well. I made sure that I put some of my sets in the custom box. You know, these are just the Mattel made extras that I had. I didn't want to make sure that uh, we do have those two WrestleMania Rollins right here. Got uh, pre-match Rollins right there. And then we got post-match Rollins right here with his shirt off and his wrist gauntlets off. And he's smiling. He's got the sledgehammer from Triple H. So yeah, we just we just got a lot of stuff to do. So I figured I'd make this quick vlog for you guys show you what's going down and We are getting prepared. I'm gonna spend most of the day trying to get all these walls filled man As you can see there's a ton of wall space. There's a ton of stuff that we got to get going 
mostly over here though i want to like i said i want to get the crowd going over here i think over here is where my gaming setup and stuff will be i'm definitely going to do a room tour when it's all said and done to make sure you guys know what's going down how it's hung and everything i want to know your guys opinion please let me know in the comment section below how i should do this shelving should i do them on the wall should i have my tall shelves again let me know down in the comment section below again i want to do like hanging shelves that way i can put each individual superstar on each shelf you know so i can have the timeline shown Instead of, you know, how I had it previously, it was just them in a row, and you really couldn't see all the figures. So I want to make sure you can see all the figures, have it look real nice. But that's going to do it for this video, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Subscribe to the channel for more epic WWE and WWE figure-related videos. Leave a like if you enjoyed the video. Comment down below what you think I should do with the room and how I should set it up. Check us out on Patreon.com slash MyDamnToys for some awesome rewards. Check out our first ever t-shirt, teespring.com slash MyDamnToys. All the links are in the description below. Follow us on Twitter and Instagram at MyDamnToys, and I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you.